Hi friends, good day. Today we are going to see about 3D animation pipeline. A walkthrough for beginners. Those who are new to the animation industry can get an idea of how the industry works. Let's move on to the presentation. First, animation pipeline has three stages. Pre-production, production, post-production. Pre-production post pre is mostly like a prep-up area where the appearance of character set duration will be decided for the episodes or movie which uh, whatever the client has done. Production is where the idea gets real. Post production is where the final touches are done before releasing the series to the audience or client. Let's look deeply into each stages. Pre-production comprises of 2D characterization where the characters get a look and height comparison to other characters. 2D set model gives the idea of how the environment looks for the 3D modeler to design the same environment in software. 2D concept explains about the episode in a depth manner for the modelers and animators to gain the knowledge about the series. 2D animatics is the base for animators to allocate the duration for a single shot and what kind of set and character should be used in it. Production is where the action takes place. 3D modelers will create character and set from the idea and preference mentioned in pre-production. The created models will be sent simultaneously to texturing and rigging departments. Texturing department defines the skin tone and details of the character which could be possibly shown by the texturing. A rigging department uses IK and FK joint to rig the characters which enables the animators to do animation. In 3D animation, three phases are there. First, 3D layout which is nothing but assembling characters, set, camera and mentioning the time frame for that shot. In simple words, 3D version of 2D animatics is described as 3D layout. Next comes blocking. Here the animator blocks the main action of the character in the shot. This is done to save time, effort and rectify mistakes at the early stages. Once blocked action is approved, next comes the animation where in between poses, secondary animation and fine tuning happens. This completes the production stage. Post production is a stage which adds the needed FX light for the shot and delivers it to the client. Lighting and VFX department creates the ambience, FX and light needed for that shot and moves the file to rendering department. Rendering department renders each shot in different layers like shadow, bump, texture and targa separately. They further move those files to editing department where these layers are organized and audio is added for final delivery to the client that is for the audience to watch. Hope this helps you guys a little. Until the next video, bye bye and good luck. Thank you guys.